place does have a very, very terrible history because it's so old and ancient and people were killed here. People did die here. Oh my God. No. <gasps> oh, lights on, lights on. Something came at me in the dark. I'm Mo Sarji. <laughs> That's how we do it. I travel the world to seek out haunted and abandoned places to document the unknown for your entertainment needs. Go, go, go. Careful. From abandoned ghost towns to, hide right now. to being locked up in the basement of haunted mansions, those ghosts or spirits would tell her, build this, build this, to fighting for my survival on deserted islands. And when I'm not pissing off demons in haunted mental asylums, I'm exploring underwater caves and using giant magnets to find treasures. <laughs> Subscribe to My Crazy Life to become a part of the adventures. Yo, top, my boy! Live a little. But what? What is it? Oh my god, look at the fucking eyeball. Turn your light off. Turn your light off. Turn your light off. Oh my god. Oh my god, please turn your light off. What the hell? Oh my god, oh my god. No, oh, no, Jesus Christ. no, 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 that's not fucking real. Oh my God. No, bro, that's not fucking real. There's no way that's real. That's crazy. I'm like shivering right now. I'm, my, like I'm about to tear up. Dude, where were you standing? I was standing right, oh my God. So it's literally right in front of you? <laughs> so for those of you that don't know what's going on, I'm freaking out right now. This is crazy. I, I We weren't filming, we were just taking photos in the dark because my new iPhone, takes photos in the dark, his new Samsung takes photos in the dark, and sometimes when we take photos in the dark, we might capture something. So I'm just casually taking photos, and there's a f eyeball on the screen. That's crazy. Dude, that's an eyeball, no? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, um, they're not gonna be able to see, so I'm gonna put a picture of it yeah. right here on the screen. There is an eyeball. See, I took, I took with a flash, okay. and then without a flash. No, that, is that real? Yeah. What the f is that? Dude, what the f That's literally like a f***ing face. I've never seen a f***ing picture like that before. Bro, you saw my reaction. I like Dude, your you literally jumped. I don't know how I managed to capture an eyeball. Let me show you guys what's going on here. There it is right there. That's a f***ing eyeball. So here we go, guys. This is what I captured. I took a, a photo. So this is zoomed out, and this is zoomed in. And this is outright an eyeball of something. Like, I don't know what the fuck this Dude, is. Dude, I've never seen that before. Yeah, the, I, I can't, I don't know what it is. It's just freaking me out though. I kind of want to take some more take pictures. Some pictures yeah. See if we can right capture this, more. So we've turned off all the lights as you guys can see and now we're going to take the exact same picture that I just took. And... Something is literally like breathing down my neck. Right I can now. feel that too. Feel it, right? I thought that was you. No. Okay, I'm, I'm trying to take these pictures as quickly as possible. I took about four so far, you guys. This is some next level shit. This is real paranormal hunting right here. This is what we do. This is what we deliver to you guys. Okay. Oh my god, no. What the f is that? What is that? Dude, that looks like a guy standing in front of me. It changed colors. That's so weird. What? Oh my god. It's literally right behind us. <laughs> What's behind us? Something. I don't know. Look at my EMF right now. Okay, lights off. I'm gonna take a picture through this window and let's see. You yeah, I heard something behind you, but let's just take pictures. Who cares what's behind us? <laughs> I don't even care anymore. This is too awesome. <laughs> yeah, this is really, really cool. Until I and see eyes in front of me. Okay, I took three pictures of the same area and now I'm gonna take another. <gasps> oh, lights on, lights on. Oh my god. What are you? Did you see something? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Something came at me in the dark. Something just literally came at me in the fucking dark. I'm when not. Our, I'm not. When dude. our lights came back on, I literally saw something right here. Yeah, it was. It came. It, it came from this door. And dude, I just took photos of that door. And let's see if I capture something there. Nope, nothing this time. This was the window. I caught nothing. But I'm gonna take a couple pictures quickly of that window there. Yeah. You know what we need to do? Huh? EVP recorder. That freaked me out. Wow. That was a legit most Sarge scared reaction. So right now, because I did capture what we thought or what looks like, I mean, it's evident. It looks like an eyeball. To me, it looks like a goat's head with half an eyeball, one eye. That signifies something demonic, like a goat. A goat figure is like a satanic figure. And this is an asylum. 
and we have been asking demons to show up. Seems to be in like this one area. Yeah. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take out the recorder and record audio and see if we can capture something on the audio recorder. We already know you're here. If there's anything that you wish to say to us, you can speak into the device on the chair that you're oh. sitting. Look at look at my K2. Wow. Pure red. Pure red, right here by the chair. There, dude, there, there's no doubt in my mind that what we just saw was something very demonic. And I bet you anything, it's still here. Mine too. Pure red. Yeah. Pure red. Red is very dangerous. There is something very yeah, evil in that thing. Wow. Holy shit. I know to you guys, it's probably just light bulbs, but to us, we're professional paranormal investigators. This is pure proof, without a doubt, that there is something here with us right now. And look, now it's not doing it. If this thing was malfunctioning or something, it'd be doing it nonstop. But look, I'm gonna I'm ask it on command right now. Demon, can you please control my K2 meter? See? Yeah. Look at that. I ask it to control the... I'm about to f cry. Can you make it stop? Did it, just stop? it stopped. There's no f way. Dude, there's no way. I want you to hold it. Here, I want to prove to these guys that... Here, I want you to hold this. Yeah. Bring it up near the camera. It's already going off. <sighs> okay. I hear it. Demon, can you please make my K2 meter go off again? And do you feel that really strong gust of cold air? Oh yeah. I'm like literally freezing right now. Demon, can you make it stop again? No, it doesn't work. Oh, there we go. That's what crazy. What more proof do you want? <laughs> like, this is that not is even... Insane. Like, this shouldn't even be real. Like, this shouldn't be real right now. Oh my God. I know we've captured a lot of paranormal in the past, but this... What is that? I don't know. <laughs> that was something was walking over there. This is like this is the I don't know the creme what's de la creme. Going on right now, Demon, it's... thank you so much. I appreciate you. Not really. You're a piece of shit still, but like you're a demon. Let's be real here. But like, this is cool. And yo, Tama boy, screw you. Okay, good. I'm still alive. Alright guys, we've spent 
countless amounts of probably almost two hours in this room through clips and stuff and uh we've 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 just come to the conclusion that this room here has something very 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 evil in it or there's something evil following us so we're gonna make our way downstairs because we have explored the entire third floor we're gonna make our way downstairs and see if we captured or will capture anything down there here we go Give, giving you guys an extra long video today we haven't explored the second floor yet you know there's a basement here yeah, I know, I saw that. yeah. <laughs> we have to go to the basement Absolutely. no 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 matter what we have to make our way down there okay two meter isn't going off down here now yeah it just got really cold so as you guys can see we have made it down to the second floor I'm not getting anything on the K2 here meaning it could be maybe that thing is just upstairs yeah. but hey let me ask Demon, if you're with us right now on this floor, can you please make it go to red again? It's not here. Not here. Not here at all. Oh. Whoa, this is another room. Kind of like that room we were in upstairs. This one's kind of in better condition now. I just wonder what these rooms were used for. I think these were the rooms that, like, where they would give them their pills, they would see the doctor. Oh, obviously, they had fresh buns. <laughs> <laughs> fresh buns. So as you guys can see, the K2 is not going off here. So it's not some... Wait, did it, did it just go off? Demon, are you here with us again? No, I, don't, I thought I seen it, but I don't think so. So we're directly under the floor that we were in upstairs and this thing was going crazy and I seen the eyeball in the photo. If there was some sort of electrical current just localized to that room, this thing would be going off right now, yeah. but there isn't. So whatever it was doing that was attached to that damn chair. And that's bizarre. Right now we are making it into the basement because the second floor was kind of repetitive and we didn't really find anything up there. So I don't want to waste your time and just putting clips that don't need to be there. So right now, wait, how far down does the basement go? I'm so confused. I feel like we've been going down like three different floors yeah, now. There's like one door here. What? Is this not the basement? Wait. Where is this the first floor? I don't know. Look, there's more stairs that go down. Yeah. This doesn't make sense to me. I thought this building was only three floors. Yeah, no way in hell we can get out from here. So this is the official basement. Hopefully it's not too flooded. Oh, it's muddy. Oh my god. This is fucking scary. Oh, this looks like a prison cell. And they, obviously the K2 meter is going crazy down here. What? Yeah. Yeah, we, oh. Guys, look at these doors. It's almost like, oh, so much water. It looks like there's a lot of furniture in that room down there. We should uh, definitely make our way there, but we're gonna get soaked here. Oh, yeah, it's bad. <laughs> it's pretty bad. Look at this furniture over here in this room. We haven't seen too much furniture in this place. I don't know why furniture excites me, but it just, you know, proves that there once was people down here. What is all this? Oh my God, I thought that was a person. Holy. Wow. What the hell? Look over here too. There's like paintings everywhere. So this is, I think there's tunnels down here somewhere. This was like the power plant room of some sort. This is scary. What the hell is this? It just almost looks like a, like a little confinement cell. I'm sure it might have been a bathroom at one point, but it just looks like a cell. Why would anybody make a bathroom look like that? And look at this, there's... <sighs> what? So there's like a crawl space with a bench inside. That's weird. Holy shit, guys, look at this, there's a cage over here. So, we're going through these underground basement tunnels. And just check out the site that I'm looking at right now. It almost looks like a prison cell. But it's obviously not. And I can't believe that it actually closes. That is freaking 
terrifying. We need to keep going. I I, I want to see what's where these tunnels go. Like most people come here only in the daytime because they're so terrified. Like literally 99% of people that come here and make videos. We come here and we stay here late at night. And we're giving you guys results today because of that. And that's hard work. So smash the like button. This is awesome. Making our way down this really creepy hallway now. This kind of reminds me of this other mental asylum that I've been to in New York. Deep in New York City. Something's here. Yeah, but it, it sounded like a door creaking yeah. at first. Oh, dude. Look at this, tunnels. Yeah. I found them, oh my God. Oh, holy shit. Like we're in the basement already and these things go downwards even more. Oh my God. I don't know if I wanna go in these right now though. We'll see, we'll see. It's very strange because it seems like as we're walking through this basement, it seems like it's going deeper underground. Yeah, like the ceilings are getting higher. And we stumble upon this over here. Let me let that focus for y'all. Now that is scary. This guy just left me alone. Yeah, no thanks. No thanks. Yeah, it just keeps going. It keeps going, huh? Oh my God, and it's so wet here. Yeah, she's really oh. wet. I mean, like, there's nothing really exciting, but, like, the fridge and stuff is all down here. I mean, maybe this is something more than like... I heard a female scream. Did you? Yeah. I don't know if the camera picked up on that. But I just heard it. It's a very faint one. What the hell is this place? Whoa. A morgue? There's fridge, yeah, but... Oh, dude, look, look. This may have been the morgue area. There's a scale here, like a human-sized scale. Sorry? There's a human-sized scale. Really? Yeah, this might have actually been a morgue area. Right there, that's a scale. That is a scale, right? Yeah, oh my god. So, I don't know if they would weigh humans on that, or if they would weigh... I, I, like, we don't know if this is a morgue or a, a freezer, but why would the kitchen freezer be all the way down here? What's in there? Yo, this is definitely a morgue freezer, bro. Think so? Look how long it is. Don't go in. <laughs> it doesn't smell like food, it smells like a morgue down here. Like, you know that smell it never goes away. We've been to a lot of hospitals and a lot of abandoned places with morgues and they always smell the same. So I'm inside of another freezer. Uh, I, I think these were actually just the kitchen freezers and not a morgue, so I don't think this was a morgue at all down here. Um, but there definitely is a morgue in one of these buildings. Keep in mind, there's 10 other buildings like this on the same property. We've only scratched the surface. We're gonna be here a few days just exploring and filming. Yeah, there you go. But look, there's a chute here, but yeah, this is definitely looking like a cafeteria. It amazes me how they would put cafeterias deep underground, like, it's scary, if anything. I don't know about that, but. What is this supposed to be? Look at this elevator over here. What the hell is this room? This still goes down on another floor, you know that, right? Jesus There's an elevator shaft and it goes down deeper. What the hell? I don't know what this is. <laughs> what happened in here? Yeah. It's so like weird. a fire or something. I wasn't recording that. Three or four footsteps. It's like sound like somebody literally walked past us. Did you? Were you recording? Yeah. We need to review your footage. Did, it guaranteed, you caught that on cam. Really <laughs> yeah, we'll review it at home. 
that was that was a very strange footstep. I was trying to get a cinematic in this really creepy door, and it sounded like three or four footsteps behind me, walking really fast. And it wasn't the water; it was actually somebody walking. I wasn't recording that. What was it? Three or four footsteps. Like yeah. Somebody, somebody literally walked past us. Did you, were you recording? Yeah. Making our way into another tunnel area. There's just so many like mazes. We're kind of lost actually. If we wanted to get out of here in case of an emergency, we would not know how because there's literally only one way in and one way out. And we've lost that. Yep, another tunnel. And now it seems like the tunnel is climbing upwards and look at that more rooms more mazes what the heck man imagine working here back in the day it would have been super scary yeah you would literally need a map oh look at this i think we found a way out dude look at this there's a ladder oh my god there's a demon on the wall <laughs> what are the odds of that so I'm climbing this weird ladder. Where does it go? This is very strange. It just goes into like this area. It's like another maze area. Yeah, it's like, it looks exactly like what we're in right now, but it goes, it's like through the building. It's weird. So we found a staircase that goes back upstairs, hoping it takes us back out from where we came in from. Oh, look at that. Doors wide open. Yes. yes. 